ತಶ್ಯಾರವಿಂದನಶಪದಾರವಿಂದು ಕಿಂಜಲ್ ಕಮಿಸ್ಸ ತುಳಸಿ ಮಕರಂದು ವಾಯು ಅಂತರ್ಗತ ಸ್ವಾಭಿವರೀನ ಚಕಾರತೀಶಂ ಸಂಕ್ಷೋಭಂ ಅಕ್ಷರಜುಷಾಮೋಪಿ ಚಿತ್ವನ್ನ ತಶ್ಯಾರವಿಂದನಶ ಪದಾರವಿಂದು ಕಿಂಜಲ್ ಕಮಿಸ್ಸ ತುಳಸಿ ಮಕರಂದು ವಾಯು ಅಂತರ್ಗತ ಸ್ವಾಭಿವರೀನ ಚಕಾರ ತೇಷಂ ಸಂಕ್ಷೋಭಂ ಅಕ್ಷರಜುಷಾಮ ಚಿತ್ವನ್ನ ಗೌರಿಯ ಗೋಷ್ಠಿಪತಿ ಶಿಶಿಲ ಭಕ್ತಿ ಸಿದ್ಧಾಂತ ಸರಸ್ವತಿ ಗೋಸ್ವಾಮಿ ಭೂಪ ಪರಮಂಸ ಜಗದ್ಗುರು ಸೇದ್ದ ದ ಓನ್ಲಿ ಡ್ಯೂಟಿ ಇನ್ ಅವರ್ ಲೈಫ್ ಹ್ಯೂಮನ್ ಲೈಫ್ ಇಸ್ ಟು ಡೂ ಹರಿ ಭಜನ್ ನಥಿಂಗ್ ಹ್ಯಾಸ್ ಗೌರಿಯ ಗೋಷ್ಠಿಪತಿ ಶಿಶಿಲ ಭಕ್ತಿ ಸಿದ್ಧಾಂತ ಸರಸ್ವತಿ ಗೋಸ್ವಾಮಿ ಠಾಕುರ್ ಪ್ರಭುಪಾತ್ ಪರಮಂಸ ಜಗದ್ಗುರು ಸೇದ್ದ that on the only duty in our life in this human life is to do only hari bhajan but hari bhajan is not a matter of job while staying in the material stage we can try our best but we cannot under the guidance of sadguru if i can take shelter luckily and the lord of speed of sadguru without any duplicity finally by the mercy of guru kipa by the mercy of guru i can get power because from the beginning to end from the beginning to end we will have to depend upon guru guru kipa hi kevaram no other way right from the beginning up to end even after leaving body we will have to follow our gurudev in eternal dham also so guru ki pa hi kevalam without guru ki pa no way point is there whatever philosophy we can discuss whatever philosophy we can discuss but still it is impossible to fi- to to make you understand exactly about what is happening there in vaikuntha jagat because we have no practical experience only we hear from shastra everything from guru vishnu we have no practical experience about vaikuntha dham so exactly what is there we cannot imagine because it is beyond imagination and guru vishnu out of causeless mercy going to give some example going to give some example which looks like material example no other way if you go if guru vishnu if guru vishnu going to speak all about the transcendental world then we cannot understand we have no experience our experience is related to this material world we don't understand everything what we never saw we don't understand anything what we never saw we don't understand what you don't feel they are like nothing and all experiences we have all material experiences but still we have the privilege we have the advantage to go through brihad bhagavatam rito lagu bhagavatam rito jaiva dharma rasamrita sindhu by the help of which we can we can proceed but near approximation exactly we cannot understand by the mercy of guru pad we can near approximation we can and by full guru kripa and bhajan we can realize yeah, that is very rare but still we can keep for everybody is not cheated sadguru is there so power must 
we can get prabhu speaking we are busy with mind body intellect everything we are busy with material body material body mind and intellect and whatever looking around we are busy with this by the help of which never in infinity period we can reach aprakita dham aprakita vastu kabhu prakisho gochan nahi material experiences material experiences is not sufficient to clarify this point what is happening there in aprakita jagat papa speaking in shastra we know there is some analytical discussion about atma man mind and sarir three different kind of things in shastra we can get information about atma man mind and body all different atma is different mind is different and body is different atma is chit particle that we know many time you heard atma is chit particle mind is chit abhas like nama abhas like nama abhas you know not actual nam mind is also is chit abhas mind is chit abhas not chit but it chida bhas like nama bhas yes and body is matter mind is also matter but it can be mind is also matter because we know from gita bhumi rap analo bayu kham mano buddhi devasya ahankar ityam me prakriti rasta so mind is also material but it is chida bhas mind is also material our intellect mind our thinking everything material but still mind is chida bhas chida bhas so there is some basic difference between atma is chida chitkon mind is chida bhas and this body is matter mat they have their respective difference and in shastra there is some analytical discussion about this three also be careful ja chiratma chit particle whom i can say i myself usually we are pointing out this material body as i myself but i myself self mean that atma but we cannot see we cannot see that atma but we be careful atma is the owner of this material body and mind without atma they cannot maintain their existence follow and the properties of atma it seems to be translated into material body and mind not actually but it seems the same example mahaprabhu gave one iron bar if i put into fire for long time though iron bar iron rod have no power to burn anything but being in contact with fire for long time can develop this kind of burning capacity similar thing due to atma present there in the body all our limbs mind intellect all seems to be active if atma gone no activities all become spoiled so atma is the owner of material body and mind material
I mean body and mind is the property of Atma. And Atma is the property of Paramatma. Atma is the property of Paramatma. They have no information about that. Only living life with enjoying mood, no idea, no basic idea. Atma is the property of Paramatma. If Paramatma is not there, I told from Setasatara Upanishad, they are bluesum, bluesum friends, never going to leave each other. Paramatma is always staying with Atma, but we are no flame. The day we can feel Paramatma, then our realization can reach a high level. Now, we are hovering around the material world, our conception, our idea, everything. Atma, I mean Jivatma, having two titles. Jivatma having two titles. Jivatma having two titles. Jivatma having two titles. One is this material body about which we deserve, this is my body. That is, one is material body, another is fine body. Follow. Two title. I told many times, that whatever title there in infinity world, wherever, whatever title, all given by Maya. The only title which is not given by Maya, that is called Jive Swarupai Krishna Dito Das. This title not given by Maya. It's quite natural. This title is eternally there present with the Atma. The problem is that we cannot feel it. What is the problem? That we cannot feel it that much. But all other, all other title, whatever title, wherever it is, all given by Maya. All title given by Maya. So, Two titles, one is uh, one is material body, and another is fine body. Fine body, uh, I already told, man buddhi, man, mind intellect, mind intellect, man buddhita, heart, anka, four, constituent of shukshma upadhi. External body is made up of five elements of nature. I mean, by the help of different Paramanu, cell, Antar Deho, inner body, Manusik Deho is a driver, inner body, I mean mind, Sukshma Deho is a driver of the external body. Atma in bonded condition, Atma in bonded condition, Atma in bonded condition unnaturally by the help of mind going to give, going to get in connection with foreign element. Follow what is it? Atma in bonded condition, unnecessarily by the help of mind, going to get in contact with foreign element. Foreign mean material element. Usually, Atma, Chinmay should get the association of Chinmay thing, but usually not happening so. In bonded condition, Jivatma, by the help of mind, getting in connection with material mind. Remember, many times I told, mind can be compared with chariot. 
sitting in which jivatma can travel in panchal panchal khetra follow before i told you can remember mind can be compared with the chariot jivatma sitting in the chariot and traveling in different places of five elements of nature panchal khetra shab शब्द स्पर्श रूप रस गंध ट्रेवलिंग अराउंड टू एंजॉय विथ एंजॉय मूड दैट्स वाई इज इन बंडेड कंडीशन ना वॉट इज कॉल सेल्फ वॉट इज कॉल सेल्फ सेटिस्फैक्शन वॉट इज कॉल एक्चुअली सेल्फ सेटिस्फैक्शन दे डोंट अंडरस्टैंड material enjoyment material satisfaction they think it is our satisfaction they are in confusion great confusion atma cannot be felt by force nayan nayam atma pravachana nilabhyo no medhaya no bahu na sutino jam eva ishurabhyo hmm different evidences are there in shastra nayam atma poshana no midhaya no bahu no sitano jam eva isha praniti tena labhya tasya isha atma vrinite vipinite tanusham hum hum Bhagwan going to accept as you are mine. In that case, automatically the mystery of Atma Tattva can get unveiled before us, not before that. So, in bonded condition, Atma usually sitting in the chariot of mind and going here and there, getting in connection with material things. and due to illusory energy we are in trap of mind popa speaking popa speaking when us when the owner of the house owner of the factory owner of one office malik if not present then the servant can do whatever they like Fancifully, they can run their life. When the owner is not present, then they can run here and there, whatever they like. They like to do. So, when the owner is not there, so when the owner is not there, then all the servant, service holder can do whatever they like. because they are interested their interest is their those who are servant their interest not going to tell you the interest of the owner but in your bhajan field our interest should tally with guru pad pad guru vishnu that's why in kirtan you can remember you are hearing in kirtan we know गुरुमुख पद्म वाक्य हृदय करिया ऐक्य आरना करियो मन आशा गुरुमुख पद्म वाक्य गुरुमुख पद्म वाक्य हृदय करिया ऐक्य आरना करियो मन आशा वी शुड नॉट हैव एनी सेपरेट आवर हार्ट शुड हार्मोनाइज विथ गुरु पाद पद्म वैष्णव इन सच ए वे दैट इट बिकम इन सेपरेबल that is a success it become in inseparable that it is a success so if the owner is not there or owner is sleeping then usually those are servile old old as servant they are not going to seek the interest of the owner rather they are going to follow their own interest to chit
So this is the condition. Mind is changeable. With this material mind, bhajan is not possible. But when our bhajan kriya is over, we can start sadhan bhakti. By the mercy of Guru Padmanit, we can find our mind, change of mind. You can remember many times I told one sloka what our Sanatana Goswami in Brihad Bhagavad wrote in the first, you know, Khanda. It is second part going, more than half over. So, Krishna Bhakti Sudha Panath Deho Dohi Kavishrite Tesham Panchavotik Dehopi Sachidananda Rupata. What I say? Krishna Bhakti Shuddha Panath Deho Daihi Kavishite. Tesham Panchavotik Dehopi Sachidananda Rupata. I mean, a practice of Deho can appear. Aprakita Deho can happen. This is the condition. So mind is changeable. Today what I like, tomorrow I don't like. You know, yesterday what I rejected, today I am going to accept. Mind is this kind of condition. Frickle mind, changeable. So mind is changeable, but Atma is not changeable, it's intact. Anyhow, if you like to burn, if you like to give water to Atma, uh, but anyhow, Atma is not changeable, intact. And infinity such Atma are there, Infinity such Atma. Each Atma has some individual characteristics. So mind is changeable, but Atma is not changeable. The duty of mind either to enjoy or to reject. Attachment or detachment. But the duty of Atma, try to understand. The duty of mind is either mind can go with enjoyment or can reject. Follow. But the duty of Atma is to serve Bhagavan. The duty of Atma is to serve Bhagavan. The only duty. Nothing else. So, three dimension. Mind can be extended up to three dimension. Follow what I say. Mind can be stretched or extended up to three dimension. After that, fourth dimension cannot understand. Because the Four dimension means adhaksha jabastu. <clears throat> mind has no right. Mind has no right, no capacity to reach up to the point of fourth dimension. All our, all our material experiences going to help us all the time. But here all material experience is useless. Useless. So many times Prabhupada used to say, logical interpretation, logical interpretation cannot stand in the way of that absolute truth. This way we can never know Bhagavan. Impossible. We can never know Bhagavan. 
Bhagavan is impossible to know. So we have no idea, nothing. So we are very much interested to depend upon Gopakumar. We are going to get first hand experiences, not that by agent. He himself going to different places like Bhur Bhubaswa Mahajano Taposhattu, different places, is going and giving us first hand experience. We are very grateful until the lotus feet of Gopu Kumar. We cannot pay him. He is going to speak about his own experiences, direct experiences. You can remember, you can go back one month before. There you can remember, I was discussing that a Gupu Kumar speaking in front of Mathur Brahman, his disciple, about his own experiences. And within these experiences, he is going to explain about the advice of Vaikuntha Parshat. After that, we are now successful to reach up to Vaikuntha. I mean, we are following Gopaguma. That's why I am speaking. It is not possible for me to go to Vaikuntha, but I am speaking Gopaguma reach Vaikuntha. So that's why we are following him. So he is going to speak about his own experiences, what happened there. He is speaking. I was waiting outside. The parshad all going inside. And I am waiting and watching whatever miracle happening. And Gopagumar speaking about his own experiences standing outside the gate of Vaikuntha Dham already, outside the gate of Bhagavan. Sasmin eva bilapaike Krishnam parikaram nijam akinchana ihoiva kitaya dhyana dhyano rasaplutaha kechit bichitru rupani dhritva dhritva mohur mohur bichitro bhusanakaro bihara dhyamanu haraha many Exceptional personalities, they are entering into the area of Vaikuntha inside. Some of them with personal paraphernalia, different nice, nice, you know, decoration of the body, full of appliances sometimes, some of them, some of them with appliances, decorated with appliances, some of them like Niskinchan, Deeply, you know, immersed in dhyana rasa, meditation. They are entering to Puri. Puri means Bhagavad Puri. Some of them with different kind of diversified, you know, diversified rupa figure they are taking because they are from they are taking different different kind of you know rupa manoha very nice fantastic figure they are taking and different kind of decoration of body bhushan Different shape and design, Bhushan, Akar, Bihar, Bihare, Manoharan. They are going to catch their figure, their decoration, very attractive. Very, very attractive. Very, very attractive, their figure. 
So this way they are enjoying their movement, their decoration, their mood, their activity is going to catch my mind, draw my mind. Now, after that, I told one month ago, before Gaurapurnim, Kechit Nara, Banarascha, Deva, Daitaha, eh? Tatharushayo, Pare, Baranasramacharo, Dik. Diksha Lakshana Dharinaha Indra Chandradi Shadri Shastri Netras Chatur Netrananaha Chatur Bhujaha Sahasrashaha Kechit Ashto Bhujaha Stata. What speaking? With full attention here Kechit Nara Banarascha Deva Daistaha Stathari Shayu Pare Varnas Ramacharu Diksha Lakshana Dharinaha Ch Indro Chandradi Shatrishas Trinetras Chaturananaha Shatur Vijaha Sahasra Shaha Kechit Ashtu Vijas Tata Hollow Parese Gopakumar watching some of them having human figure, some of them like monkey, some of them having, you know, Devota, Deva Murti, some of them Daitya Murti, some of them Rishi Murti, after that I saw some of them Those who are following Varnasramachar, according to that, they are motivated, they are going. Some of them having their figure like a man after living, taking Diksha. Diksha Lakshan Mudradi. After taking Diksha, you have some separate kind of symptom, na? So some of them is decorated with a symptom as if they are already uh, initiated by one great personality, maybe. Diksha, Lakshan, Sarup, Mudradi, their activities, their bodily decoration like Vaishnavas, you know. Some of them like the figure of Indra Maharaj, some of them Chandrama, Chandra Devata, Sadrisho, some of them having three eyes follow, some of them four eyes, some of them four hands, some of them thousands of faces, some of them Ashto Bhuj, Sadrisho Murti. Deep, different, different kind of figure, diversity we are watching. We are watching. This way they are decorated. Now point is there. Now point is there, there are some question can arise. Why this kind of di diversified things are visible in Vaikuntha? Gopakumar are watching. This absolute diversity visible there. Gopakumar speaking, I can speak the reason after. As a but basically, Krishna Bhakti Rasa
going to harmonize everything. I mean, basically there is Krishna Bhakti Rasa. If somebody can get the taste of Krishna Bhakti, if somebody can get the taste of Krishna Bhakti, then all proper adjustment can be visible. There is fighting, there is politics, there is jealousy because we are not getting the taste of Krishna Bhakti Rasa. Krishna Bhakti Rasa, Krishna Bhakti Rasa is the topmost property, topmost treasure. After getting this taste, nobody likes to fight with each other. I told uh, a few days before, you can, you can remember about Naraji and that hunter. Naraji Maharaj giving answer to that hunter, well, it is quite natural that those who are getting the taste of Krishna Bhakti, they cannot have any doubts and suspicion, fighting mood, jealousy, nothing possible. So Naraji Maharaj speaking, it is quite natural, who Hunter, it is quite natural that you are developing all nice, nice qualities which a Vaishnava should have, which a Sadhu should have. That you are getting. It is quite natural. Because those who are engaged in Hari Bhajan, they never like to give pain to anybody. They never like to insult anybody. Whereas some foolish society, they are so foolish, so foolish, they think themselves we are very intelligent. They are speaking, it is good, very good, that there is jealousy, different kind of comment passed by our Acharya. They are so foolish, so fallen, they don't, un they don't understand the far-reaching consequence of this insult. It is written in fourth canto, Usually, if you insult Guru Vishnu, they never try to insult you to take some revenge. They never insult you. If you insult, you can insult. They can keep silence. If you insult Guru Vishnu, Guru Vishnu can never speak anything against you. They can keep silence. But the dust particle from the lotus feet of Guru Vaishnava cannot bear the offense done by you. Follow. It is written in Bhagavatam 4th Canto that if you do offense unto the lotus feet of Guru Vaishnava, they cannot speak anything. But be careful. The dust particle from their lotus feet can never excuse the man who is committing opera. Be sure about it. So, if there is bhakti rasa, what I mean to say, if we can get the taste of bhakti rasa, then we can automatically find all proper adjustment everywhere. No disparity. Since we are not getting the taste of bhakti rasa, so different kind of problem arising. Etat parama bhai chitri hetu bhakshahamiti agrata Krishna bhakti rasa shad Krishna bhakti rasa shad avatam king shatna sundaram. What speaking? Etat parama bhai chitri hetu bhakshahamiti agrata. Krishna Bhakti Rasa Shado Avatam King Shatna Shundaram Everything become very nice. Everything become very nice. All proper adjustment can be seen if one can get the taste of Bhakti Rasa. If no Bhakti Rasa, then fighting is a must. 
So it is the duty of Suddha Guru Vaishnav to arrange their testing. Of course, those who are having duplicity can never come out successful. Of course, if they leave duplicity and try to make their heart straight, then okay. Etat parama vai chitra he tom bakshaham iti agrataha. Krishna bhakti rasa shadavatam. King sahat nu shundaram. What is not good? What is not beautiful? What is that? Everything. If bhakti rasa you are testing, then no problem. Usually problem happening. Because Bhakti Rasa is not there. All Acharyas, all followers, they are busy with material thing, material enjoyment. That's why they are fighting. Remember, Sarvo Prapanchati Tanam Tesham Vaikunta Basinam. Tasso, Vaikunta Loka Show, Tasso, Tan Nayaka Sacha, Tani Mahatmaja Tani, Prapancha Antar Gatui, Kilo, Drishtan Tweer, Nopo Junjante, No Shakyante, Chavasitum. What speaking? Is speaking all prapanchatito, all those Vaikuntha Parshad, they are beyond this material limit. They are actually beyond this material limit. So those who are residing in Vaikuntha, they are beyond in any material limit. Then Vaikuntha Loka. Then Vaikuntha Loka. And what is there in Vaikuntha Loka? And what is the Sarup of that Vaikuntha Bhagavan and Parshat, Asim, Hari Ananta, Hari Rupa Ananta? Kaise koi bhave. You can apply your brain, but you cannot come out successful. That Vaikuntha Nayak, having infinity glory, glorification, infinity, infinity glorification, infinity, infinity glorification. Bhagavad Bhakta, those who are residing in Vaikuntha Jagat and Vaikuntha Dham itself, and the hero of that Vaikuntha Jagat, Bhagavan himself, Vaikuntha Nayak, their, glor their glorification. Their glorification, I mean the glorification of those Parshadas staying in Vaikuntha Jagat and the glorification of Vaikuntha and the hero of that Vaikuntha Jagat, Bhagavan himself, their glorification cannot be done, their glorification can never be done by the help of material example can never be expressed. What is there? What is there happening? Who they are staying? Who is Bhagavan, the owner of Vaikuntha? Anyway, by any amount of philosophy, any amount of mental exercise, 
we can never express it. So, so, it is not appropriate on our part. So, it is not at all appropriate on our part to take the example, to take some material example, to clarify the point there in Vaikuntha. It's not possible. But still we are doing it. Follow what is it? All the glorification of Vaikuntha Dhamma, Vaikuntha Parshavas, and the owner, hero of the Vaikuntha, their, glor their glorification can never be done by the help of any material things, material examples. So, <clears throat> it is not appropriate. But what to do? What to do? Usually this is happening. Shukdev Goswami, Vaisdev Goswami, who not? They are going to give us material example because we can at least approach near approximation. Exactly it is not possible. While staying in the material world, while, while staying in the material world, it is impossible to realize or to explain what is happening there. Not possible. Sarabhu prapanchati nam tesham vaikuntu vasinam Tasho vaikuntu lokusho Tasho tat nayakashacha Tani mahatmu jatani prapanchantar gataikila Drishtantair no pajujyante Na shakchante chabhasitum any amount of lecture, philosophy, is not just sufficient to give the example. To give the example is one kind of effort, but actually not possible. What is happening there in Vaikuntha Jagat? Uh, any amount of example cannot stand. Diversity there in this Aprakita Jagat also. Not only that, in material world, different kind of diversities are there. Well, different kind of diversities are there in this material world. But that is not Aprakita. But different kind of diversity, countless diversity available in Vaikuntha Dhamma, that is not at all material. It is a prakita. So, Parat Parakrisha Parabrahma Bhagavan is decorated with infinity diversity. Unity in diversity, diversity in, in, in unity. Within Bhagavan, infinity diversity, hollow. And within infinity diversity, we must learn to see Bhagavan is there then everything can be harmonized. Unity in diversity, diversity in unity. Sarabho prapancha titanam tesham vaikuntho basinam tasso vaikuntho lokusso tasso tannayakasso cha tani mahatmo tani mahatmo jatani Prapancha antar gato ikila, distan toir no pajujante, na shakyante chavasitum. Okay, you are right. But still, what to do? It is not possible.
to represent a prakita vastu by material example. But still, what to do? No other way open before us. You know, if you go to Abad Puri, a prakita yagat vaikuntha, where Ramchandra is saying a yodha, you can find Anumanji Maharaj, you can find Nikharaj Jambuban, Jambuban, Shukriv, you can find diversity. But you should remember, they are simultaneously different and non different from them. Though diversity you can find there, in Ayodha, by Kuntha, Ayodha, there you can find Hanumanji Maharaj present, Nikharaj, Bhalu, Beer, Jambuban, you can find Sugriv, diversity there, but still unity is also there. According to their seva, according to their mood, they are taking different kind of, you know, sarup to serve Bhagavan. But within this diversity, everything is well, uh, well harmonized because there is bhakti. Because there is bhakti, sarvo prapanchati tanam tesham vaikuntha basinam tasso vaikuntha lokusya tasso tat Nayakasya Tani Mahatma Jatani Prapanchan Taragatai Kila Drishtan Tvairano Pujijyante Na Shakyante Chabhasitum It is beyond explanation. It is beyond any explanation. It is beyond any explanation. Now, the next sloka we find, 42. Tathapi bhavato brahman prapancha antar gato shahi prapancha parivar antar dhishti vir dhishti 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 gat dhishti gavhitas chetasa but tathapi bhavato Brahman Prapanchantaragata Sahi Prapancha Parivaranta Drishti Dishti Govis Govitas Chetasaha. Follow. And after that is written Tad Drishtanto Kulen Naibo Tat Tat Sad Bodhitam Sukham. Tateti ucheta yatkinchit tadagaha kamatam harihi. What do you think? We don't understand what is the thing. Tatapi bhavato brahman prapancha antar gata sahi. Prapancha parivar antar drishti drishti govi to chetasa. Tadrishtan to Kulen Naibu Tatat Shad Boditam Sukham Tateti Ucheta Yatkinchit Tadagaha Kamatam Hari Gopaguma speaking Gopaguma speaking to his disciple Mathur. Vipra, oh Vipra, there is diversity, exclusive diversity, unity also there, but you are at present staying in this material world. There, diversity is there, unity is also there. But because you are staying, you are actually Ved Murti. Brahman is Ved Murti. But still, a Mathur Vipra, you are at present physically present in material. Maybe mentally gone somewhere.
there is diversity, but still you mathur vipra, though you are the feature of Vedamurti, but still you are in this material world. Prapanchantargato, you are staying here. That is why your heart or your inner vision cannot cross over the limitation of material thing. Prapancho parivarantaragata achetana asachetan vastu nichaye nikhipto havate vastu taha siddha gyan avrito rayaji. Gopaguma speaking to that Mathur Vipra, you are the feature of Veda, Veda Murti. But still, at present you are in Prapancha Antargata. That's why your heart, your inner vision, busy with Chetan and Sachetan in this material world, Prapancha. Prapancha Parivarantaragatu Achetana Sachetana Sunni Kipto. You are having connection with this and all material thing. Prapanchantaragatu Vishaya. So, your Chittaviti, your inner vision cannot cross over the limit of prapancha because you are busy with all inert or chetan vastu, what is visible in the material world. So your natural gyan, your Shiddha Gyan. I told many times, you can remember, don't forget that Atma is Gyanmoy, Atma is Chinmoy, Atma is Gyanmoy, Atma is Anandamoy, Atma is Prakashmoy. All I told many times, you can remember. Atma is Chinmay, Atma is Prakashmay, Atma is Gyanmay, Atma is Prakashmay, Gyanmay, Chinmay, Anandamay. That's a quite natural with Atma, it's quite natural with Atma, nothing miracle, it has. This has to be there, but because of Diti of Abhinivesh, dual conception, your inner vision, your inner vision, follow, your heart, it is somehow attached with material thing visible here. But to do? That's why I am bound to give some material example to make you understand. I am bound to give material example. At least I am successful to give you relation up to near approximation. That's why I am bound to give material example because I know it's useless, but what to do? So, tathapi bhavato brahmana prapancha antaragata sahi prapancha parivar antadrishti govi toschit sa drishtanta antar kulenvo Tatyat sad boditam sukham 
तथेति उच्चेत यत किंचित तदाग खम खमता हरि दो इट इज इम्पॉसिबल टू गिव डायरेक्ट एग्जाम्पल फ्रॉम वैकुंठ जगत सो भगवान श्योरली कैन एक्सक्यूज मी बिकॉज आई एम बाउंड टू टेक सम मेचुअल एग्जाम्पल टू क्लैरिफाई दिस पॉइंट दो इन प्राकृतिक जगत मेचुअल एग्जाम्पल इज ऑफ सेलेक्ट You should not give, but you must give. What to do? What to do? No other way open. Shukla Dev, Bhaj Dev, who not? Everybody giving material example to clarify their point in front of us. This is a must. so now gopakumar speaking to his disciple mathur brahman tathapi bhavato brahman prapanchantar gato sahi prapancho parivarantar drishti गोभीतोश्चेत सह तदृष्टाकुलेन तत्सादोदित सुखम तथेति उच्चेत यत्किंचित तद आगहा क्षमता हरि आई एम बाउंड टू टेक सेल्टर ऑफ दिस मेटेरियल एग्जाम्पल टू क्लाइफ फॉर दिस पॉइंट इन फ्रंट ऑफ यू सो आई बेक फॉर पार्डन इन फ्रंट ऑफ सुप्रीम लॉ Because I should not give me, but I am bound to give. No other way open before me. That's why. So Bhagwan must excuse me. I pray for that. No other way open. So now, Tatra. तत्रुत्वांशाम्यम परस्पर तारतमच लक्षेत न विरोध तथा वेरी नाइस सिद्धांत गोपकुमार स्पीकिंग इन वैकुंठवासी दे हैव देयर रेस्पेक्टिव difference they are be we are their everything activities all has some speciality tatratvanch sarvesham tesham sammam parasparam taratammancha lakshyeta na virodas tathapi cha do there is countless different diversity they have mutually i mean individually respective there are some speciality some taratam or taste is different but still there is no contradiction there is a unique harmony prevailing everywhere follow like we say in kirtan you can remember guru mukha padma vakya hidayat koriya vaikko arna koriya mona asa we will have to harmonize your heart with guru vishnu properly that is called our success now it is a speciality of vaikuntha jagat also i told many time before there can be some diversity 
but you can find unique harmony among them. I can give you example. Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, all his parcels, each one of them having some speciality, some different mood of seva, everything. I am not speaking material, but of practice. Okay. Sivas Pandit, Gadadhar Pandit, Sivananda Sen, Bhakkesha Pandit, Sarup Gosai, Jagatananda Pandit. Why not? Eh? All different. Jagatananda Pandit become angry. Bhagavan not accepting while, while, well, while. Ayurvedic while. To apply on head. Mahaprabhu. Jagatananda become angry. This is also tasteful. This is not material angry attitude. Mahaprabhu speaking well. Jagatananda, you are going to carry one pot of Ayurvedic oil for me to apply my head. But you know, I am sannyasi. How I can accept, you know? So your, all your effort, all your energy can come out successful. Whatever energy you have spent for this purpose to bring the pot from Bangla. If you can give this wild pot to Jagannath, those panda, they can use it for the lamp, so your energy can come out successful. But Jagadananda become very angry. A practical angry attitude. You become, ah, who told you? Who told you I bring oil from Bangla? No. Then taking the pot of oil, I'm going to throw in the baranda to break and all oil and oil everywhere. <laughs> so, different moods. Jagadananda having different mood of service to Bhagavan, Sarubhusa having different, Rairamananda different, Rupa, Sanatan, who not, everyone, all different moods, not same. But still they have some unique and absolute harmony because their ultimate goal is to serve Chaitanya Deva. Tatrottancha, Tatrottanancha, what written? Tatrottvanancha sarivi shamti sham samyam parasparam Tarotammancha lakshetana virodas tatra picha Though there is you, countless diversity but still there is no infighting, not contradictory. All going to be adjusted properly very, we can find the absolute harmony there. Though you can find Jagadananda angry, but Jagadananda is totally harmonized with Mahaprabhu, Mahaprabhu is also harmonized with Jagadananda. Totally. So much love Mahaprabhu has for Aham Bhakta Paradhina Hi Asatantra Ivodiyo. He is speaking. So, in Vaikuntha Jagat, it's not a problem. But in this material world, countless diversity can engage us in infighting. Oh, he is doing this, so I can also so. Uh, why he can go? I cannot go. He is enjoying so love puja, but I can also get. This is contradiction. This is competition. This is fighting, this is called jealousy. This is called jealousy, which is not possible in Aprakita Dharma. So what to do? Everything is harmonized. Everything, all and everything, each and everything, we can find totally harmonized in that by Kuntha Jaga. But in material world, not possible. There is some diversity, but material diversity, no harmony, <clears throat> some jealousy, fighting, politics, competition is a mass. Because it is not Vaikuntha Jagat. Vaikuntha, here, here, whatever. However nice relationship you can grow, husband and wife, or brother and brother, mother and father, mother and sister, mother and 
son, father and son. But still, it is not beyond material limit. You should remember, it is within those limit is material limitation. So, contamination must be there, more or less, like Prabhupada many times told us, in this material plane, material planet, maximum love affair we can find with Nal Damanti, this kind of example of the love affair between Nal and Damanti, Laila Majnu, follow, Jim Dela, unparalleled, unbidden love affair. Unparalleled, unbeaten love affair can be seen in the material world, but still not free of any contamination. There must be some contamination. Contamination is a must because it is not by Kunta Jagat. Hesitation is the inherent characteristic in this material world. Hesitation must be there. Disciples speaking to Guru there. <laughs> But with some hesitation. But Siddha, Guru Pad, Padma, like Prabhupada, Bhakti Mani Chakmur, there, hesitation is not. <coughs> Follow. <coughs> but because though they are, though we can discover they are in material world, but still they are beyond material world. They are staying in Vaikuntha Chakra, I mean Goloka Minda. Hesitation must be there. Without hesitation, no relationship, not even a single relationship you can find in the material world, except pure Vaishnavas. I am speaking of the material world. Vaishnavas externally staying in this material world, but they are staying actually in Aprakita Jagat. So, harmony is a must, but here in this material world, hesitation is an, is an inherent characteristic. It has to be there, it must be there, without which we cannot imagine. But Shuddha Guru Vaishnava saying in the material world, that example I cannot give. Because I cannot say Prabhupada must have some hesitation, no. Prabhupada is beyond any limit, material limit. Bhakti Tagore. So, at all, if you find any defects with Siddha Maharaj, Kesha Maharaj, that you should not count, that you should not count, that you should not count, I know, how you can count? This is Aprakita, no? Vaishnavas apparently they can have some defects, but we should not count it. If we pay attention this kind of, you know, then it's not good. Then it is not good, it's very bad. Aprakita Guru Vaishnava, I already gave example. I gave example, Mani. Those Vaikuntha Parshadas, they already gave example to Gopagama. You can remember long ago, I was discussing. You can remember. Long ago, I was discussing, you forget. Gopakumar, two Gopakumar. Vaikuntha Varsha staying, that those pure Guru Vaishnavas, they are staying in the material world, but they are aprakita, they are not material. Follow. Then, to erase any kind of doubt in this Siddhanta Vichar, Gopakumar was bound to say, that you see Gopaguma, you are from Govardhan Bindavan, you love Bhagavan, that's why you also love you. We like to help you anyway. 
But you see, we are from Vaikuntha Jagat, yes or not? Yes, yes. You are from Vaikuntha Jagat, you are the Parshad of Vaikuntha, yes. Then how we are here in the material world? Oh, really? Yes. We are Vaikuntha Parshad. Then how we are here talking with you in this Mukti path? How it is possible for us to go here and there, even in Martha Loka, Bhur, Bhubaswa, anywhere? According to the order of Bhagavan, we are reaching, but still our aprakita body, we are not going to leave. We are aprakita. But still we are troubled. So how not possible, Guru Vaishnavas, while staying here, they are aprakita, why you cannot believe? You should be. So, if any defects, if you like to find out some fault with Guru Vaishnava, it is impractical. Guru Vaishnava, those who are aprakita, they cannot have any defects. Cannot have. Though externally you can discover some defects, oh, that Vaishnava like this, the Vaishnava is this, but you should not count. There can be some physical defects or behavioral defects, but you should not count. Because Vaishnava is beyond any material limit. They are aprakita. Drishtvai shabhava janita irva puschato shair na prakita tami havakta janasya pasyat gangyam basamna khalu budhibudu fena pankvair brahma dhabattam apagachati nida dharmai What? Drishtvai shabhava janita irva puschato shair Rupa Goswami was already told, because Rupa Goswami knew. Rupa Goswami was already told, there can be some so-called devotee or man who can find defects with Guru Vaishnava. That's why to give warning, he is speaking, Drishtvai shabhava janitai ravapuscha dosair na prakitattami avakta janasya pasyat Gangyam basam na kalu budu budu pena pankvair Brahmadda bhattam abhagachata nira dharmai Was speaking? Rupa Goswami was speaking Drishtvai shabhava janitair vapuscha dosair na prakita tamiha bhakta janasya pasyat If any physical defect or any behavioral defects can be there but it is not defect because Vaishnava are operating no, prakita tamiya bhakta jana sapat said, you should not find any fault with him, that devotee. Rupa Goswami Bhatt gave an example, like in Ganga water, sometime we discover dead body flying, a, a, you know, floating, or dead dog, dead cat, Fox, oh, so nice. Eh? But still, you can find some fall. Because in the water of Ganga, you can find some bubbles and some dirty things. The wicked people, they are throwing everything in the Ganga. Follow what I say. But still, Rebukasana Srikil, Ganga is Ganga. Ganga is Ganga. Ganga is Aprakit, Chinmay, Dhava Brahma. Ganga is Brahma Drava. Mahaprabhu used to come to take darshan of Ganga and take bath in Ganga. It is called Drava Brahma, liquid Brahma. Like Brahma can stay in the form of sound, Bhagavatam. Yes or not? Especially we know from Kirtan everywhere, Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, Bhakti Mataji writing, on indifferent Kirtan, Bhakti Mataji also writing, Kali Kale Nam Rupe Krishna Avatar. 
in kalikal bhagavan appear in the form of naam physically bhagavan cannot come but come in the form of sabda brahma kalikale naam rupe shakto avatar kalikale naam rupe krishna avatar krishna appear krishna can appear in his kalikal in the form of naam naam brahma so if naam brahma possible shakto brahma naam brahma sen liquid brahma shastra bam okay bhakta bhagwan is also like the discussion took place i like to remind you like the discussion took place between ana dava brahma a uh, a uh, महाप्रभु एंड सर्वोमर्थजो महाप्रभु गिविंग एग्जाम्पल ओके आई कैन टेक बाद इन गंगा एंड ऑल्सो आई लाइक टू रिमाइंड यू पुंडरिक विद्या निधि ही नेवर wanted to see ganga in the day time because day time due to sunlight you can discover some bubbles and dirty thing floating in the ganga some dead body something floating in ganga but but ganga is dova brahma liquid brahma brahma himself and in purushottam kento daru brahma jagannath balade subhadra jagannath is daru brahma mahapur speaking and ganga is dava brahma liquid brahma bhagavad is shabda brahma follow what is it drishtvai shabab janitai rava puscha doshair न प्राकृतमी वक्तजन से पश्य गंगसा न खलु बुदबुदो पिफेन पंक ब्रह्मदत्तमगछत नीरधर्म पुंडरिक विद्या निधि यूज टू टेक दर्शन ऑफ गंगा इन द नाइट टाइम बिकॉज बाई चांस इफ सम डेड बॉडी दिस फ्लोटिंग इन दई कैन डेवलप सम problem oh so dirty then offense can be there bhakta bhagwan bhakto is also bhagwan like sanatan goswami when he developed some skin disease in the body mahaprabhu forcefully going to embrace sanatan sanatan flying don't catch me don't catch me don't touch me but still mahaprabhu going to embrace and kiss later mahaprabhu told to sanatan sanatan it is the testing of bhagwan it is the testing of bhagwan bhagwan going to test me so bhagwan going to create some skin disease in your body at the same time watching me whether i hit you or not if i going to hit you then i can develop great offense so mahapur giving this judgment by creating some by developing some skin disease in your body bhagwan going to test me also in south in the in south indian trip also in south indian trip you can remember when mahaprabhu going to embrace that kushti vipra vasudev vipra we all the process in the whole body how possible so mahaprabhu not going to watch any defects with any devotee mahapo teaching us you should not hate so i never hate the stool and urine of vaishnavas i used to clean i never i never hate any if they develop some contagious disease i never hate 
because I know their body is Aprakita. But there should be Aprakita Vaishnava, like Bhakti Bhumat Puri Gishri Maharaj. You know, all great, great Vaishnava, you know, our Sattagavinda Maharaj, they are all body. Follow what I say. They are expressing some disease before living body, like Bhakti Bhakti Valatita Gishri Maharaj. Bhakti Pumaturi Goswami Maharaj, Santu Goswami Maharaj, they all. But this is one kind of drama to test me and my faith, belief and faith in Guru Vaishnava. So, it is one kind of testing. Tatrottvanancha sarvisham tisham samyam parasparam taharatamyancho lak Lakshetana Virodha Stata Picha. So, one should not find any defects with Guru Vaishnava. There cannot be any defects in Guru Vaishnava. The example, I already this Drishta. Dhrishtvair sabhava janatir vapusya dosair na prakhizat tamiha bhakta janasya pasyet. This example I give you. At the same time, I give so many examples by the help of which you can realize that Vaishnava sarir is not material. Vaishnava charitra is also a prakrit. Vaishnava charitra sadai pavitra jeninda hingsakuni. Vaishnava Charitra is always pure. There cannot be any defects. But, but Dakha Prajapati is going to find so many faults with Paramahansa Acharya, Shivji Maharaj. Though there cannot be any fault, though there cannot be any single fault in Sankar Bhagavan, Paramahansa. Nimna ganam yatha ganga devanam achutu yatha. Eh? Nimna ganam yatha ganga devanam achutu yatha. Eh? Vaishnavanam yatha sambhu purananam tu idam bhagavatam. But still, Dakha Pajapati is going to find so many faults. He is dirty, he is staying in you know, crematorial ground, so dirty, not taking bath, all ghost and you know, snack all around. Oh ho! Shadbhir, eh? Shadbhir Padar Sitamarg, Vedamarg. Teno Dushita. I mean, he is going to blame that the pure Vedic Dara is going to be contaminated by this foolish Sankar. <laughs> Sankar, his body is dirty, his, you know, all asses from crematory applying on the body as cosmetics, not taking bath, nothing. Oh, all around ghosts, staying in crematory and ground, no purity, nothing. <laughs> so, Sankar Bhagavan is topmost paramansa. At any condition, Bole Baba is pure. But, Dakha Prajapati is going to find so many faults with him. What to do? Those who are habituated to find fault with each other, you cannot stop them. You just cannot stop them. They are habitual. Their life, their whole life, their, their whole life, they are busy. To find fault with others, they cannot see their own faults. So, it's quite natural. Though Sankar Bhagavan is a Prakita Vaishnava, but still, Dakha Pujabhati can discover him in the material plane, material plane in crematorium ground, dirty, so many things. But Shankar in his Sarup, 
Sadasiv always in Vaikuntha Tattva. But what to do? Tatra, Tatratvancha, Tatratran, Tatratvanancha, Sarvisham, Tisham, Sammam, Parasparam, Tarotammancha, Lakshetana, Virodas, Tatha, Picha. There can be countless diversity, but still harmony must be there. This is the symptom of Vaikuntha. Without any hesitation, there cannot be any hesitation. Hesitation is not there. Hesitation is also in, only in the material world. Vaikuntha, everything free and aboveboard, clean, fair, very aprakita, no defects. Nothing. So, Gopaguma speaking to his disciple, Mathur Brahman, No maschajjada yodu sa santi kashyapi te suhi Gunaha savavi kabhanti nityaha satyaha sahasra saha No Mashajadayu do Shaha Santi Kashyapi Te Suhi Gunaha Savavi Kovanti Nityaha Satyaha Sahasrasa No Mashajadosho was speaking No Mashajadayu do Shaha was speaking no maschajjada yudushaha santi kashyapiti shvi gunaha savavi kabhanti nityaha satyaha sahasrasa There in Vaikuntha Dhamma there is no jealousy in anybody. There are mutual love and affection prevailing, aprakito natural relationship there. Naturally, they are humble. Naturally, they are going to give honor to others, amani manat. Thousands of such natural qualities are prevailing in this Vaikuntha Jagat. Everybody having decoration of different qualities. Namaschajjadayudu shaha santi kasya piti suhi Gunaha savavika bhanti nittaha satyaha sahasrasa Somebody can express doubt. Well, there can be some... Well, somebody can express doubt. There can be some defects, some problem can be there, but not possible. It is Vaikuntada. Any material qualities cannot reach there. Maya is thrown, Maya is thrown long away by Bhagavan. Even cannot touch Viraja were to speak about Maya to enter into a Prakita Jagat. Even cannot touch the prakita water, chinvai yalarasi of viraja. Staying this, this side of viraja, cannot cross, follow, cannot cross. So, it's quite natural. No maschajjadayadu shaha santi kashyapi te suhi. Gunaha Savavika Vantinityaha Satyaha Sahasra Saha. Thousands, hundreds of thousands of such natural qualities can be found in Vaikuntha Jagat. In material world, Mike Jagat, untruthfulness or you know unstable in material world, unstable and uh, 
In material world, all material. Except Suddhu Guru Vishnu and Dhammas appear, now that. All other things material. But not like this. In Aprakiti Jagat or Aprakita, material qualities cannot enter that area. Aprakita Vastu Kavu, Prakita Gochar Noi. Aprakita Vastu Kavu, Prakita Gochar Noi. We can remember the reason for why Jai Vijay, well, they, both of them were cast, cursed by Chatusan, because Chatusan reaching by Kuntha, but they suspect the doubt, they cannot allow them. Chatusan thinking, how you can develop this kind of discrepancy, duplicity? Actually, in we reach Vaikuntha. Vaikuntha, there is no hesitation, no mass The Why from this kind of quality develop in you? So better you can go to material world to take birth as demon. Foolish. Shanksho Vamaksara Jusano Pijitta Tonaha. Follow what he said. Tashara Bindana Nasapada Rubindu. Kinjal Kamisa Tulasimakarando Vayuhu. Antaragata Sabivari in a Chaka rotation. Shanksho Vamaksara Jusano Pijitta Tonaha. Banchakal Badru Shikipa Sindhu Vijapati Tan and Pavan and Bob. Krishna Pyo. Here I am bound to stop. Excuse me. One chakal paturu sikhe pasindu vavicha patitanan pavanibho vishnabhyo namo namaha.